All right, we should be about ready to begin here, finally. I should finally have everything set up. So, the very first 24-hour stream we've ever decided to do, huh? And I have the camera pointed over here because we're doing Undertale oven mitts, so you can see, like, the oven mitts on the keyboard and stuff. So... So... Yeah, so I've never done a 24-hour stream before, and I have a whole bunch of things planned for this. Hold on, I need to open the actual thing. I need to stop that music. Hold on, ooh, momento. Where's my project with the... With the plan? Here it is. I need to open... I need to open this here. Is what I need to do in my video editing program. Because we have a whole bunch of things planned for this. This is going to be intense. I wanted to start at 6 a.m. It's now like 15 minutes after 6 a.m. I mean, I've been live before then with the stream starting soon screen, but silly me, I was like, hmm, what's a good I what's a good time to start at to be able to start streaming at 6 a.m.? Oh, I don't know. How about freaking... <laughs> How about freaking 5.40? What? Oi. Properties. There we go. There we go. We have a whole bunch of stuff on the schedule for today. So... First of all, we are doing a 24-hour charity stream to help fundraise for Larch Edmonton, which is a community that helps people with developmental disabilities by creating like day programs for them, helping them live their lives by identifying their skills, sometimes finding them jobs, stuff like that. It's really cool. Every year, my Taekwondo school fundraises for them. Every every student who wants to participate, it's very much just like, oh, take an envelope at the front desk and go out there and like help to fundraise because our our master believes very heavily in the importance of giving back to the community. So, so every year we do this event called the Breakathon, where we all go out and like fundraise in our own unique ways. This this being mine, this being my own unique way to fundraise, I suppose. And yeah, j basically just like filling this envelope with however many funds we manage to gather and such. And and we bring it along, and during this event called the Breakathon, we get to break a certain amount of boards based on how much money we raise. Like we get so many tickets for like so many boards to break with whatever techniques we want. Like I'll typically do like one or two boards, and I'm done. And then I have all these extra tickets that like I never use, and I just either give to someone else or recycle because I've. Because I only ever want to do like two things, maybe. But yeah, and like Larch comes there themselves, and they get to break boards as well. Like our master of the Dojang, there he'll hold the boards himself. It's a pretty cool event, and that's where we present to Larch all the money that we fundraised for them. So it's a really cool event. So for everyone going out and fundraising in their own unique way, this is how I'm doing it: 24-hour charity stream, which I've been told at the Dojang there is possibly the most intense fundraising anyone has ever done at that school, and I don't, I don't doubt that. So, we're starting out, you can already hear the music for Undertale. It's 6 a.m., and we're gonna be going for three hours, we're gonna start out with Undertale Oven Mitts Challenge genocide, the genocide route, so like the really hard route. I figured we'd start with this at 6 a.m., because it's something I actually have streamed before in the past, so I figured like, who's gonna be up at like 6 a.m. on a Saturday? So let's, so let's start out the stream with something I've already done before, so it's not like there's anything brand new that's going on, but still something that is like incredibly, incredibly wacky to be doing here. Then, after, once we reach 9am, we'll stop the Undertale of Emits challenge, and we're gonna transition into Fire Emblem Awakening, where I'm gonna be playing on Lunatic Plus Classic Difficulty, which makes it the hardest game I have ever played in my life. I've actually beaten Lunatic Plus Classic before, a few years ago, like way before I streamed. That was the hardest game I've ever played. Like, once you've beaten the fourth chapter of the game, then you have access to the DLC, then you can grind however much you want, and then the rest of the game isn't as hard. So like, the prologue and then the first four chapters are real- is like where 70% of the challenge is. But the prologue and chapter two especially, those are both like, time to reset like 3,000 times. And there's like specific routes that you should be taking to- <laughs> to have the best chance of actually being able to beat it, which I meant to study before streaming, but I forgot to last night. I kind of ran out of time, so oops. Oops, I might be looking up guides in the middle of that. I'll try it a few times on my own merit to start, but we'll see. And then, 
once we do three hours of probably just resetting the tutorial level honestly we're gonna transition into the legend of zelda skyward sword my favorite legend of zelda game but we're gonna be playing it on hero mode and i forget what hero mode actually is why my music stop oh okay um i forget exactly what it is i think you take double damage and hearts don't spawn i think that's what it is or something but we're gonna be playing it with a Wii Remote rifle, like a Cabela's Wii Remote rifle. And, uh... It's motion controls, it's a motion controls game, so the Wii Remote is your sword, and the nunchuck is your shield, so you shake the nunchuck, and it causes the shield action, and you have to swing the Wii Remote in different directions for it to be the sword. But in a Wii Remote rifle, it's the same apparatus. So I was testing this out a couple days ago off-stream to see what it'd be like by playing against the final boss on normal difficulty, and because it's one apparatus, you shake one and you shake the other so Link can't stop doing spin attacks, which is what happens when you shake the Wii Remote and Nunchuck together. Like, I can get the Nunchuck to be shaken on its own by, like, shaking out the hilt of it, but it's much more difficult to shake the Wii Remote on its own, let me tell you. And it also makes my left wrist flare up a little bit with its, like, weird injury that I got a while back, so I'm gonna have to, like, put a wrap around it to, <laughs> to have it flare up as little as it can anyway then we finally transition into like choices those who like pledge to larch during the stream will get to choose what goes in these slots so after we do these three hours of legend of zelda skyward sword we're going to transition into connect games i set up my xbox 360 connect i tested it and it only actually it only actually acknowledges me when i stand on like this couch at the back of the room there, which the camera's not on right now because the camera's pointing down at the keyboard because like oven mitts challenge. So I'm probably gonna have to like stand on the couch for the camera to see me. Though that couch also does fold out into like a bed kind of thing. So maybe I can just fold it out and then make it easier for me because I don't really want to stand between the two cushions and have to keep my balance in addition to <laughs> doing the stupid connect games. So I have like a few choices of connect games that can be chosen. And then it's just 12 hours of like stuff that those who pledge for large can choose, which is probably gonna be pretty crazy. So if I go to the other slide here, so here's the kind of rewards that I have for those who fundraise for large. So like the minimum amount that Streamlabs lets you give. So first of all, the donation thing is just through like my Streamlabs, so it goes to me because I. Like, it has to, because I have a freaking envelope that I literally need to, like, put it in, you know? So that's why it goes here first. It's because I got an envelope to shove it in. But yeah, so Streamlabs, the minimum is $1. Like, that's just the way Streamlabs is. So anybody that gives at least that, I'll be giving a new permanent color roll in my Discord server with the color code of Larch here. And it'll be, like, Larch Donator 2018 as a permanent recognition that this is something that you supported. And then for each, like, $10 Canadian, people can choose a game to put into a time slot. Time slot being, like, any of these things. But a maximum of one Connect game, a, max a maximum of one choice before 12 a.m., and a maximum of one choice after 12 a.m. So basically, it's so that one person can't just, like, fill up all the time slots in a in an area, you know? So it's kind of distributed out. So each person can choose a maximum of one of these three connect game slots, a maximum of one of these six pre 12 a.m. slots, and a maximum of one of these post 12 a.m. slots. I guess would 12 a.m. itself count as post if you're gonna be really accurate? Well, it does in this, which is why there's a little dash line to separate them. So there's like a maximum of three slots that you can fill, but they're like distributed out so that it leaves like space for others to be able to choose stuff. And as for the choices, I basically just looked at my shelf and was like, okay, what's something I would never otherwise stream? What's something that's stupid looking? What's something that's meme -y? What's something that would be really funny for me to stream? Stuff like that. So... So, I looked at my shelf and looked at a whole bunch of stuff. So we've got Spongebob Atlantis Corpantis on the PS2. A random Pirates of the Caribbean game. Pac-Man World 2. I've never played World 1. I don't, I don't own that game. There's a freaking golf game. I don't know why, but there's a COD game on my shelf. <laughs> for whatever reason that I've never played before, I've never played a COD game. There's a first Assassin's Creed game. I originally had Smash Melee here, and I did manage to find my Wii and the game, but, uh, I couldn't actually find the power cable for my Wii, so there's 
there's that. But I have the a special challenge kind of thing planned out for planned out for Dead by Daylight if someone selects that. The Reddit killer challenge where I basically just go around doing OP builds as killer and then calling all the survivors survive with friends. Because that's what Reddit killers do. Then I have a whole bunch of Wii games like Poke Park, Pikachu's Adventure, Wii Sports Resort, Wii Fit. Oh yeah, one condition. No Wii Fit in this slot directly after Connect. Not allowed. I'm not gonna be doing three hours of Connect to directly into an hour of Wii Fit. That's not allowed. Wii Fit can be in any other slot, but not the 6 p.m. one. Not allowed. There's Mario. There's the first Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games game. I don't even know why I have that. But from like Beijing 2006, there's Eminem's Beach Party, there's Guitar Hero World Tour, there's Hell's Kitchen for the Nintendo DS. There's Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild because my love hate relationship with that game. Roller Coaster Tycoon Adventures because that game sucks. Skyrim because it's a meme. Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate because it's like the playthrough that I never continued and it's like weird and stuff. Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2. Friday the 13th, the game because I kind of really don't like it and it feels like nothing but. Nothing but like kids play it nowadays from what I'm from what I'm aware of and there's like voice comms in it and, ugh, Gross planet coaster because I don't normally stream it and I threw minecraft on there because like And why not it's a thing and then for connect games These are the things in my connect games library. I don't know why so to fill those like three time slots there We have connect Avengers, connect joyride spongebob surf and skate the freaking connect star wars game I had no idea there was even a Connect Puss in Boots game, but apparently it's on my shelf. There's freaking Kung Fu Panda 2 and there's Wipeout for the Connect. So we have a bunch of choices here. If somehow one if somehow we get to one of these slots that's not filled, then I'll just like choose it randomly or like ask my subs or something like that. So that's what happens for like each 10 that's given to support Larch. And for 20 People can basically choose for me to play something with oven mitts for the next 30 minutes. Obviously, the current game doesn't count because that's the whole point of like what I'm currently streaming, Undertale oven mitts. Like, I'm already doing it with oven mitts, but for anything else, can make me play with oven mitts for 30 minutes by having 20 bucks to support a large. As well, I have like human deliver awards for stuff that we, like if we manage to reach these amounts like together. So this is like the individual stuff and here's like the like, cumulative stuff. So. If we manage to reach 75 total for Larch, then I'm actually gonna change into my Enharmonia cosplay from Pokemon Black and White for the rest of the stream, and just be dressed up as Enharmonia for the whole rest of the 24 hours, I guess. I bumped my microphone, sorry if that created a sound. If we reach 150, which is what I have set for like this goal up here, I figured I'd set it a lot higher than what I originally had it set to just because it's like let's see if we can reach it You know and and Han comes out of nowhere. <laughs> he forced me up out of bed at 8 in the morning Arodi, I greatly appreciate it. Han, thanks so much for the 11 months I wasn't actually expecting a whole lot of people to be up at this time considering it's like 6 a.m My time zone at the beginning of this stream <laughs> So like, thanks so much, and thanks so much everybody else that's up at this time as well, because Jeebus, it's early. But this is the time that I have to wake up in order for it to... For me to be able to stay up 24 hours. <laughs> oh jeez, the freaking robot voice. And sorry I haven't been reading stuff in chat yet, I just wanted to get through this. But yeah, thanks so much for the 11 months haunt, that is so close to a year of being subbed. I super appreciate it, welcome back. Anyway, yeah, I increased the amounts here, so at 150 I have play and sing on piano, zombies on your lawn, and the Pokemon theme song. And as of last night, I was actually practicing on guitar the other side from The Greatest Showman, and I think I have the whole thing memorized now, the last time I played it on stream, which was like once ever. I didn't have the whole thing memorized, but as of last night, cramming it in like 20 minutes, I might have the whole thing memorized. Saying that, I'm probably gonna like forget it if I start to play it. But if we reach that, how about I say I'll at least attempt that on guitar as well, so there'll be three things to play and sing, not two. And then I freaking bump this up a lot. <laughs> I had 250 total to contact Atari Help Services. Like, one, because that is like a super high amount and it'd be super neat to hit. And like, two is like, it's so high that I honestly feel like we're probably not gonna reach it, but it'd be cool to shoot for. And I kind of don't want to contact Atari Help Services, honestly. 
what with like my social anxiety for like embarrassing myself <laughs> I kind of really don't want to do that but if we do that I'll do it anyway because of like my hatred for like the modern roller coaster tycoon games and the old ones used to be so good because Atari's like killing it and milking as much as they can by making terrible games I already have some ideas in mind that I could ask them on like the help services line like for example when there was the crowdfunding for roller coaster tycoon adventures if you gave at least 250 dollars you could have your name on a crowdfunding website where they would like list your name that you were a funder but i've tried to find this page and i couldn't find it anywhere so on the helpline i could ask what happened to this page and pretend to be like a funder or something like that but that is super high because uh i kind of don't want to kind of don't want to do this <laughs> but if we reach it i'll do it anyway but yeah, so that's the stuff that I'll be doing if we reach those total amounts. And what's Atari help services? Just their helpline. Just Atari's helpline for... Which I literally had to search for a while to find. I don't have it at the ready. I'd have to, like, Google it and look it up again. And you can't actually find it on their webpage anywhere. It's just, like, the help services for them as a gaming company. I assume, if that's the number that I found a while back. It's like how you'd call, like, Nintendo help service if it's like, oh, there's a problem with my Switch. I'd pretend to have some sort of a problem with Atari, because Atari sucks. You know? So those are, those are my plans. So those are all, like, the choices. There's, there's actually a couple other choices that aren't on here, just because there wasn't enough space here. Like, for example, there's any Mario Party that I own that I could play. So, like, Mario Party 7, actually, I didn't find my... It actually can't be 7, never mind, because I didn't find my power cable for my for my Wii, so I can't actually play GameCube games, never mind. So, Mario Party 8, 9, 10, Super RDS. But I couldn't list those all on here because there's not enough space, but that's another choice. I also thought about potentially having, like, Smash Bros on there, like, Smash Ultimate, but I'm not actually sure like what exactly to do there man oh man super mario maker 2 that's not out yet though and i don't even own the first one but yeah bumble lover crazy madman look at 250 you have faith we shall see there but yeah roller coaster tycoon greater than pmd2 and you know it. roller coaster tycoon is absolutely incredible like the first two especially, and then the third one close behind. But no, not better than PMD2. PMD2 is my favorite game of all time, so no, definitely not. But Roller Coaster Tycoon will always have a special place in my heart. Anyway, um, should we just should we just hop right into things here? I suppose I have like the Undertale layout set. What happened to my jar? Okay, there's my jar. Okay, so um, we're starting out with the Undertale Oven Mitts Challenge. Um, I haven't played this in a while, and, uh, oh man, oh man, I'm already starting to regret this. Oh my goodness, I'm already mashing, like, all the buttons together. Last time I streamed this, I was resetting this boss fight for two hours. Like, because we've streamed this before, we're at least already at, like, a more interesting part to watch. Yo, I'll just read it out the first time. Even though we've done this before a while back. Yo, Undyne told me to stay away from you. She said you you hurt a lot of people. But, yo, that's not true, right? I forgot what voice I did for him before. It's been like a month. Yo, why won't you answer me? <laughs> and what's with that weird expression? Oh, oh man. Man, my heart's pounding right out of my chest. What would Undyne do? Yo, you better stop right where you are. Because if you want to hurt anyone else, you're going to have to get through me first. And, and, but yeah, fair warning, you may fall asleep midstream. Haunt, it's a 24-hour stream. If you stayed awake through the whole thing, I would be very genuinely surprised if anybody is awake through the whole thing. At which point, chaos shall reign supreme. How what? Question marks, but how's everyone doing today? This is pretty early for a Saturday no matter like what time zone if it's within like North American time zones if it's in Europe then is it like seven or eight hours ahead or behind? I don't know one of the two, but at least in like North American time zones. It's like early 10 35 p.m. So I assume that's like in Europe there so or okay Australia so not Europe. I always like assume people are from like Europe when they're that different of a time zone but yeah, that makes sense. So it's super late in the day. So whenever you call it a day and go to bed, I'll probably still be here when you wake up. 
Check. Monster Kid. Two attack, two defense. Looks like free XP. Yeah, Australia. Australia. Australia doesn't exist. Exactly. What's that? What's that, man? Bam. Oh, dang it. This is going to be very difficult here. Yeah, fake news. <laughs> oh, man. I'm all sniffly. I'm like slightly sick today. That sucks. I'm dying. You're, you're hurt. What voice was I doing for her? I don't know. Maybe I'll make one up. Hurt. It's nothing. Next time, listen when I tell you to leave, okay? I'm dying. I take care of this. Get out of here. Yeah, just play along with the fake news like a good citizen. Exactly. <laughs> it's nothing. No. Just somehow, with just one hit, I'm already... Already... Damn it. Papyrus. Alphys. Escort. Just like that. I... I failed you. No. My body... It feels like it's splitting apart. Like any instant, I'll scatter into a million pieces. But... Deep... Deep in my soul, there's a burning feeling I can't describe. A burning feeling that won't let me die. This isn't just about monsters anymore, is it? If you get past me, you'll, you'll destroy them all, won't you? Monsters, humans, everyone. Everyone's hopes, everyone's dreams, vanquished in an instant. But I won't let you do that. Right now, everyone in the world, I can feel their hearts beating together as one. We all have one goal. To defeat you. Human. No. Whatever you are. For the sake of the whole world. I, Undyne, will strike you down. Time to reset this boss fight with other mids for like three hours, though it's closer to two and a half now. Also, another note, because this is a 24-hour stream, I'm gonna be having to... You're gonna have to try a little harder than that. I'm gonna be having to take like breaks sometimes to like go off from time to time to do stuff. I'm gonna have to go like grab food. Like towards the end of this Undertale of a Bits thing, I'm probably gonna have to like go upstairs, grab some breakfast, bring it back down, and like turn my camera off while I eat. But if my camera's off during this, then you guys wouldn't be able to know that I'm wearing oven mitts. So maybe I should wait until Fire Emblem Awakening Lunatic Plus Classic to get my breakfast or something like that. I'm already a little bit hungry. It's early in the morning, you know? No, you'll attempt to rain to stay awake 24 hours, but most likely fail. Watch, you'll fail the parts you really want to be here for. Yeah, 24 hours is a very, very long time. I might have stayed up 24 hours before, I'm not actually sure, but I've never gone on my way to try it before. Why not? When you wake up, I'll be doing PMD. Nah, PMD is not one of the options. I want to... I'm gonna be doing all sorts of things I wouldn't normally be streaming. PMD is definitely something I'd normally stream. I'm doing all sorts of wacky, crazy challenge stuff to fundraise for charity. I can't just play games normally to fundraise for charity. That doesn't make sense. You'll probably be on Zans by the time you wake up tomorrow. I'm only doing this for three hours, so no. We're doing all sorts of different challenges. Who cares if you're eating on camera? I care. Streamers who eat on camera are just, ugh. Like, how do you do that? It's just, nobody wants to see you, but dang it. Munch a munch and away. Okay, this is gonna suck because I literally can't feel the buttons. It's been a while since I've done this. Ah! Okay, easy peasy. I remember. I need to turn my volume down a bit. There we go. Uh, I remember how I was doing this last time I was streaming this. Um, if I got hit during the first or second attack, I would just like reset immediately just because I'd have like no chance from there if I got hit on either of those. Okay, cool. Put on a few 10 hour YouTube videos? No. No, I gotta continue with this kind of stuff. Ah! It's a very good thing I've practiced with oven bits before. That is a very good thing. It's a very good thing we've streamed this before. So I literally have practice with this with oven bits. Aw, oh, dang it. Oh, go down. I keep not going the way that I want to. I can't feel the buttons. Okay. Okay, so this is up, down, left, right. Gotcha. Okay, this phase should be easy as long as I don't be an idiot. 
In theory, okay. Phew. Command explanation. Undying is lock loaded in the Oh yeah, I forgot about that command. It's at like 50 or something right now. I forgot. That's the command that adds a counter every single time I die to undying. I forgot that that was a command that existed. We're at like 50 now or something. It's either 50 or 60. 60 deaths. Why am I playing this so good today? What the heck? Man, you can tell I practiced this. Okay, this is where the reverse thing starts. Okay. <laughs> wow, why am I so good at this today? I haven't practiced it in like a month. Like, I've practiced it, but not in like a month. All right, easy of emit strategy. Just use left and right here, maybe. All right, I'm gonna have to like heal here. Is what I'm gonna have to do. Yeah, this phase happens twice. Dang. Dang, maybe going left and right like that isn't the best strategy ever. Ha! Ha! Ah! <laughs> no! Well, here goes all my healing items. Ha! Oh, oh, not today. Yeah, this feels way easier than the last time I did Undertale of Emits. I got practice now. Ha! Huh, no! Dang it! Well, right as I say that. Right as I say that, more healing items say it means less healing items for Zans. Can't you just get them from the shop, though, before Zans? Isn't that a thing that you could do? Ha! 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 The left! It keeps not doing the way that I want to because I can't feel the buttons because of emits. Wow, I think this is actually the furthest I've ever gotten on stream with oven mitts. Maybe. I don't actually remember. Ah! This is so hard with oven mitts. Yeah, I, <laughs> I can't feel the buttons. I think that first attempt, I think that was literally the farthest I've ever gotten with oven mitts. Oh yeah, I called myself Atari for the genocide route of killing everything. <laughs> because Atari's kind of... Terrible nowadays. So yeah, it was 60 before. So yeah, we've died to Undyne 61 times then. Gotcha. Isn't that something? Man, oh man. Yeah, yeah. Man, oh man. Yeah, those... Those later phases are harder. Okay. Yeah, this definitely feels easier than the last time I did it. I'm experienced at it now. Boop, boop, boop. Ha! Huh. I mean, I could just play it without oven mitts and probably get an instant. How about we make it a 60 second? We probably will in a second here. We probably will. How's everyone doing? Anyone have any fun weekend plans? Any cool stuff? Ha! Huh. Going on! I hate these slow ones so much. That always used to hit me once when I was practicing this like a month ago on stream. I don't know why I'm like so much better at it now, but apparently I am. Just go around the outsides or something. Easy solution, right? I didn't actually mean to go diagonal there. Be undyed within 60 seconds or die and retry. No way. Huh? 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 <laughs> going to a party at 4 p.m. Nice. Nice, nice. That's always fun. Huh. This pattern is always the same here. I don't know if I actually have it memorized. That's mostly reaction, though. The chick's calendar. Ah. Uh. Oh, man. Don't worry, you have no friend. Don't say that. Not oh, like this. Ha ha ha. For a two-year-old child that your mother babysits and she's the cutest thing ever. Oh, so is it like a birthday party or something like that for this infant? But it's for the mother then, you say? Ah! I can't avoid getting hit if I just use left and right, but if I use up and down, I'm gonna for sure get hit because I'm using oven mitts. Uh-oh, I really should have healed. Oh, I really should have healed. Oh, man. 
Love you so much anyway, and... Dang, man. Dang, man. That sucks. Also, sorry that you have to see the screen twice there. I mean, I could always just, like, minimize it if you guys don't want to see it over here. I could, like, minimize all the things. That way you just see, like, my regular desktop there. Training session with beatdown as friends that are also your friends tomorrow at, like, midnight fun times. Nice, nice. Boopity boppity. Put YouTube on the other screen, why? Alrighty. Yeah, training in Smash Bros is always nice stuff. Boop, boop, boop. Ah, no! No, I got hit during the first thing. I have to... I have to just give up now. It's pretty much hopeless if you get hit during, like, the very first attack there. As I figured out when I was streaming this, like, a month ago. As I learned. So, yeah, if I get hit during the first two attacks, I... I'm done on the spot, pretty much. But, yeah. Pretty solid weekend. Nice, nice. Also watching in 140p? Jeez. Also, I appreciate you adding to the counter there, huh? because I kind of can't. <laughs> That's kind of something I can't do. Yeah, it's early in the morning, I got it. Oh, see internet, yikers. Okay, maybe I do need my OBS screen open there, just so I can see, like, what's what. Just because the inputs show up on screen for, like, up, down, left, right. I might actually need to open it again. Just because it shows my keyboard inputs there. I'll try once here without it. I think inputs are just for getting my bearings back for figuring out what buttons are what. I did it again. I got hit at the beginning attack again. Yeah. I'm actually gonna open the thing again. Is what I'll do. Is my plan. Oh man, oh man. Yeah, early in the morning, I gotta get like some breakfast. So maybe it should be sometime during this. Kind of incapable in your current state to add or type in a function matter. Yeah. What? I can't. Do I have to click on the game again? Yeah, I do. Dang, man. Dang, man. Oh, boy. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate it there. Yeah, yeah. It's just done if I get hit during the first or second attack. Okay, up, down, left, right. Yeah, I need to look at that screen there to see my inputs. That right screen. You know. Have your monitor showing the memes channel from your Discord? How about I don't do that? Oh, man. I've never streamed this early before. It feels so weird. Yeah, this feels like way less of a handicap than it used to be. When I was doing this before. Like, when I was doing this before, I was still learning this. Like, now I can actually feel the buttons a little bit. So I have a little bit of an idea what I'm pressing, unlike before, where I had literally zero idea what I was pressing. Ah! Ah, oh, come on! It's so unfair! Oh, man. Oh, dang it, I hate this one. But I'm getting better at it. Woo! There was something else I was gonna say, but I forgot. How about no? How about you don't do that? Oh, I almost went straight into that. I think the stream itself has been a meme since day one. Seriously, the community here is fantastic and chill with everything. I know, right? Yeah, this is definitely not what I... Ha, ha. Where I imagined things would be like a year and a half ago when I first started... No, less than a year and a half ago when I first started streaming. When I hit go live for like the very first time. Oh! Whoops, I messed up there, didn't I? Okay, this is the first reverse one. So you can say most things without consequences in Harmonia and chat will go along with it. What's this supposed to mean? Most things without consequences. What's this supposed to mean? <laughs> Killing up this like every 0.5 seconds. <laughs> Whoops. Here, I'll actually try using up and down too even though it's hard to feel the buttons risk it for the biscuit i need that hypo i need that hypothetical biscuit by not healing ah! no ah! oh 
<laughs> wait 10 years. Hopefully I'll still be streaming by then. I don't have any plans to quit. How did I do that? I was like panic. No, I'm freaking. I didn't even need to heal. I did that by accident. I thought it was auto selected on attack. Oops. I just wasted a turn. I just wasted a turn. I can't be wasting turns in this boss fight. Ah, no! <laughs> Consequences of like perma bands that are actually permanent. I like Carby's bands in his. Oh, yeah, he's been perma banned like 22 times. You say today will probably haunt you in 10 years? <laughs> we shall see. Aw, oh, dang it, man. Oh, it's so scary! Oh, oh do you? You'll leave that. <laughs> Jeez. Banned for dying in a game. I think I've done that before. I think I've banned people from this stream for dying in a game before. But, like, as a joke, and I unban them again, and me. Ha! Ah! Whoa, man! I can't feel. Oh, okay. I. I let go of the buttons that I meant to press there for a second. Okay. It's my last astronaut food. Oh my goodness, it's gotten faster, and there's a whole lot more spears. <laughs> it's so hard! Risk it for the hypothetical biscuit! Uh oh. Dang, man. Oh! I got stuck there because I couldn't tell what I was pressing for a sec. Oh, man. Yeah, I've never played a game called One Shot, and yeah, banning you for losing in Smash, that sounds like something I'd do. Oh, no! Oh, man. Why can't I get more phases like that? Oh no. Not this one again. I can't feel the buttons! Go down! Oh! Oh! Oh, it's so close! Oh! 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 Sticky keys? What was that sound that I just heard? The window sound. Move, 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 move. Oh. I'm so close. Yes, more phases like this, please. You like miss one button once and you're screwed for the entire rest of the attack because you can't feel the buttons anymore But I'm actually doing way better at this than I Than I did like last time I streamed this my goodness. Oh Man <laughs> You're stuck on this part also super Leto, but are you playing with oven mitts? But are you playing with the best controller ever is the question? Oh Man Here's a tip, get good. <laughs> Easier said than done when you're wearing oven mitts. Yeah, exactly, Carvey's at fault. I'm, a I'm actually getting pretty good at this with oven mitts, not gonna lie. Or right as I say that, time to give up. Oh man, oh man. I can't do it if I get hit during like the first two attacks there because every hit as there at some parts you should be in a rush I'm wearing oven mitts man <laughs> I'm wearing oven mitts to fundraise for charity <laughs> this man's painting with a or playing with a dog slash kangaroo oven mitt thing on his left hand yeah I couldn't find any other oven mitts you, you like it you like it you like isn't it great? 
you know? Man, oh man. We came so close that one time. Like, that's actually so sad. Up, down, left, right, got it. Yeah, I can't get hit during the first two attacks. 100 by the end of the two hours? Considering how close I was that one time, I think I'll be able to get it before 100 attempts. All I have to do is play it right. You know? Ah! Oh! It's so scary, man. It's so scary! Just go around the outsides. Don't worry about it. That was not around the outsides! That <laughs> last run was luck, Kappa. I hope not. Hopefully I'm actually getting better at this boss fight. So we can move- I didn't mean to go down! Of amidst things. You know. Okay, that phase is always the same. Okay. Okay. Thanks for the follow, Silver Fox. Why am I not getting a sound notification with, with that? <laughs> Why was there no sound notification on that follow alert? What the heck? I mean, I could go into Streamlabs and set it as like something else just for now. But it's supposed to be playing something and it didn't there. Why didn't it play the sound? Uh oh. I probably should have healed. I really should have healed. Yep. I'm so dead. You have immense amounts of respect for those who don't do no hits. I had a friend who was trying to do, he who successfully did a no hit. For, like, he successfully did this boss fight without getting hit. And he was trying the final boss of Genocide for a while, but he couldn't do it. I was back in high school. What sound for the follow alert? I forget what I set it to. I tried to set it to like the, the mad lad from that Mario Maker 2 direct, but Streamlabs didn't like it for whatever reason. I don't know why. This phase is easy. Okay. Come on, man. This phase is easy if I don't mess up. The moment I mess up, it... Thanks for the bit puppy okay. Oh yeah, something I forgot to mention during the beginning of the stream is like the with the cherry fundraising for large that it's just the streamlabs tips that go towards that. Like bits and subs are still just cuz they're like a like more weird and complicated system. What the heck is this face? Oh. Ah, I haven't seen this one before. Yeah, I tried to set it as that and streamlabs didn't like it. It didn't even want to upload it. I didn't even want to upload it, so I guess there's no mad lad as my follow sound. The Streamlabs doesn't like it for whatever reason. Hen! This is so scary, man! Okay, I'm so close. I'm so close. And thanks for the follow, Super Leto! I can't feel the buttons. <laughs> uh. I'm having fun fun in the sun. Let me tell you right now. Okay, that phase is actually easy compared to the crazy spinny thing. Okay, we're actually so close again. This phase is like the easiest of them all. Come on. Two more hits. Uh-oh, I can't get distracted right now. Nice save. Uh, no! Oh. And thanks for another bit, puppy o cam. Oh. 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 No! No, 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 no! Oh. Oh. Oh, one hit! Uh oh. No! No! 
dang it! I hate this! Oh, Ben! Literally one hit! That's twice now! I need to take off my jacket, I'm starting to sweat. Oh, man. I need to take this off. Oh, boy. Uh, but yeah, I, that last hit thing against beat down there. Stand to crack the improvements are being made. Yeah, this is... Like, compared to when I was streaming this a month ago, which is the last time I practiced with oven mitts, by the way. Up, down, left, right. I'm, like, way better than then. Like, I never even came close to beating it before. The furthest I could do before was, like, getting to second phase, where it does, like, the reverse pointer things. That's, like, the best that I could do before. I don't know why I'm, like, so magically good at it now. I don't know. <laughs> Thanks for the third bit, puppy okay? I'm... Because I did not practice this off stream. I promise you. Mm. How about I, considering how hard it is during the last phase and how like important it is to not get hit, I think I'm gonna change my criteria for restarting to like the first three attacks from first two. I'll just restart on the spot if I get hit during the first three because I need to conserve that like so much. Like my strategy before was like, I need to not heal until like, I can only afford to spend, like, one heal once second phase starts. If I have to heal before even second phase starts, and then just restart on the spot. Like, the earliest I should be able to is right when second phase starts, or else, or else I have, like, no chance. I'm praying that this is all build up and preparation. It pays off when you have a bad time. Yeah, considering how hard this is, I'm a little bit scared. When I first started doing Undertale of Amits, I'm not sure what the heck I was expecting. But I didn't think it'd be this hard, though this is actually way easier for me now than it was like a month ago. Like now I'm actually starting to get this down. Get this whole of Amits thing down, you know? Oh. There, I didn't get hit during the first three. There we go. I was stuck in the corner! Oh man, have you tried taking off the mitts? What would be the point of that? That's not the challenge though. What? I can't believe I got hit during that. That was dumb of me. That was really dumb of me. Yeah, that phase is always the same. There's some attacks, like the third one, where it's like, it cycles between a few different options, but that one's always the same. Same with this one. What do you mean? Poopity boppity. Ah, uh, here's where the reverse thing starts. Yeah, so now we're in second phase. So I'll use one of these. Have you tried deferring the purpose of the stream? Yeah, exactly. I hate how these spheres rotate! I'm screwed. No chance from there. I messed up during that. Spear attack way too much. She's, she's been one hit away. Twice now. Twice now she's been one hit away. Have you tried not shooting and just doing some work to get money to donate? I'm literally working full time right now. This is what I'm doing. I'm working full time for a company that does like IT work for other companies. I typically work from like anywhere from 8 to 4. Like I typically start my day at like 8 a.m. and then go until like 4 or 5 p.m. Pretty much. Do I make a clip of the end of Pacifist after genocide and you get yourself possessed? Yeah. Last time I remember you were a cleaner. I was a last summer I was working cleaning ducts. Is what I was doing. So like furnace work. So not quite a cleaner. Dang it! I got hit during the first attack! Dang it, man! 
I can't get hit during the first three attacks or else it's hopeless. It starts with the word clean? It starts with the word duct. <laughs> duct cleaner. Going to work on people's furnaces and duct systems. I actually kind of missed that job. My work partner and my boss are both awesome. It was great. My work partner and I always used to make like Spongebob references to each other and sometimes talk about game stuff. And our boss always used to like make fun of us in joke ways. What the heck was that? Like sticky keys again or something? Am I pressing the shift button? Is that what it is? Like our... Like our boss always used to make fun of us and just like... Joke funny ways. Like we were trying to use the windshield washer fluid one day in our truck, but like no fluid was coming out. So we told our boss about it and he came out and he looked at the truck. And the freaking like nozzle to actually... The nozzle to actually get the fluid to spray onto the windshield. I was pointed down, so he just turned it up, and he was like, okay, you guys, next time, next time there's a problem, first look, and 90% of your problems can be solved by looking at it. <laughs> or there was one time where the, this vacuum hose that we would attach to the furnaces, they held, like, their kind of cylinder shape because they had, like, a whole bunch of circular piece of metal in them. So whenever one would split and come out of the hose, it'd be, like, really sharp. It was pretty solid metal, so, like, the pliers that you had to use to break off that piece, it was super tough. So I remember, I remember my work partner telling that to our boss one day, and our boss was like, well, just, like, ply it off then. And my work partner was like, but it's hard. It <laughs> started smiling. <laughs> Our boss <laughs> starts smiling as well, and he takes off his glasses, and he looks at my partner, and he's like, Alright, this can go one of two ways. Either you can suck it up, and you can go do it yourself, or I can go do it, make it look easy, and make fun of you for the next week. I'm good either way. What would you prefer? And my, and my work partner is like, I'll go do it. <laughs> I kind of miss my old job. I kind of missed my job last summer. But yeah, at first, yeah, this boss fight would be like Toriel will be insta killer. Yeah, it can seem like that at first if you don't know. Yeah. Your boss is a legend? Yeah, I, I had a good time there. I had a good time working at least. <laughs> Not gonna lie. <laughs> it was a good time. Yeah, if I could have gone back to that job this summer, I probably definitely would have. I definitely would have, but the person who replaced me after I went back to school there is still working there. Dang it! I've been replaced. But sometimes if I'm in the area, I'll still stop by the building and like, stop and say hi and like, chat with the receptionist. <laughs> Catch up on things. But yeah. Yeah, this boss does have a couple of random attacks. Like, the third attack there, it's random between, like, a few different options. What? Man, oh man, I'm not sure what you're saying here, puppy o -cap. But yeah, and that's the kind of boss you'd be hot. <laughs> yeah, there's, like, so many other things that happen that I probably can't clearly remember, but... But I remember having a... Having a good time there. Yeah, you'd always make fun of us in, like, joke ways like that. It's a good time. <laughs> Made for a good laugh. Man, oh man. Boopity bop. Okay. Now let's just not get hit during this third attack here. Okay, it seems like it gave me an easier option there. An easier option that a time. I don't know what I'm supposed to do when I'm stuck in a corner like that. I don't even know. 
Okay, this is literally the easiest phase, but I still get hit by it sometimes anyway. Okay. Okay, then. Moving here in like three and a half weeks? Where's here? Actually, wait. That's something I shouldn't be asking on, like, stream. <laughs> Freaking personal identifier stuff. Never mind that question. <laughs> but... But yeah, like, moving houses, I assume, in three and a half weeks, then? That can be exciting. Yeah, I know you were mentioning that you were excited about that. Oh! Oh! Okay, I don't even have to heal here. Okay, I'll get my bearings again. Up, down, left, right. Okay, we're doing well. Dang it, man. Alright, we're gonna do the spinny thing again. We go again. Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! No! Come on! We're still doing good considering this is the first time I've had to heal. Okay, up, down, left, right. Ah! What? I was pointing down, I swear! Oh. Actually. Yeah, let's actually do that. Oh. Okay. Ah. So high stress, man. As long as I don't mess up once on that phase, it's easy. The moment you mess up once, I get hit by like all the attacks that follow. And that attack there. Yeah, I'll try, hold on. Okay, the slow one should be easy in comparison to some of the other crazy stuff that goes on there. Did get hit once, but... We're getting close, I mean... I don't know how that hit me. But whatever you say, game. This is so... Hard. I hate this super crazy spinny phase. So much. I only got hit once during it, though. Yes, I'll take this phase over the other ones anytime. Dang. Two hits, maybe? Can't afford to get hit here. Okay. Come on, man. Ah, this is hurting my knuckles so much. Bending around my fingers in weird ways to be able to actually hit it through the oven mitts. As long as I survive this attack. I can't even afford to heal because the turn that you take to heal is a turn where you're not attacking. <sighs> it's always the last attack, every single time. We're at 70. Dang it. So if I would have gotten it that last time, it would have been the 69th attempt. I... I really want to finish it off. There. Okay, my knuckles are actually hurting so much. Ow. Ow. I was concentrating so hard. Up, 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 down, left, right. Man, oh man. Yeah, this is really hurting my knuckles. I don't know why it wasn't the last time I streamed this. Maybe it's because I'm reaching the later phases. I messed up already. It's gonna be a point when you throw your hat on the ground. Uh, that, if that happens, I'd probably be more likely to be during Fire Emblem Awakening. <laughs> Honestly. If that were to happen. Oh, man. Man, oh man. Oh, 
What a world. I, I was doing so well that last run. That was my best one by far. I didn't even have to use a healing item until like two attacks into the second phase. Up, down, left, right, up, down, left, right, up, down, left, right. Alrighty. Man, oh man, if only I could just skip to the final phases. You know? Oh, maybe I know why my knuckles hurt. Maybe because I'm mashing my chair after I get so close and then fail. I hate this. I hate this so much. Oh man. Sorry for the hell you put yourself through for charity and our entertainment. <laughs> yeah, it's certainly something, huh? Man, oh man. Man, oh man. Yeah, when it comes to fundraising for, <laughs> for charities, sometimes you gotta do the insane. You know? We can get this before 100 attempts. I'm very confident in that. We're gonna get this before 100 attempts. Up, down, left, right. Up, down, left, right. We're gonna get it before 100. Definitely. Up, down, left, right. Up, down, left, right. We can definitely do this before 100. For sure, man. Do you know what might actually help me? Maybe actually getting some breakfast. 7.17 a.m. my time zone. Could be a good time to get like a bowl of cereal or something at some point. Ah! No, 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 no. No, I need all the health I can get for like the later phases so I can't afford to get hit early. I cannot. I cannot afford it. Man, oh man. But we can get this before 100 attempts. We can definitely get this before 100 attempts. Also, hold on, I just realized. Can I? Roma key out my thing? Where is. No board, here it is. Can I chroma key this? Filters. What if I change the chroma key to blue? Oh, there you go. I forgot to do that before. Normally it's set to green for like my default thing. There, that's better. I forgot about that. Sorry about the blue boxes around those fixed now. Oops. Oops. This just shows you how unprepared I am for this stream, despite the fact that I was pairing like all throughout this week when I was home from work for this stream. <coughs> Ooh. Oh man, like I got all my console set up, I made sure they all work. I have all the games that are like choices actually over here. Like, hold on. I have literally stacks of like all the games that we're gonna be playing. So maybe I should have grabbed this earlier. So we're starting with Undertale. I just pulled out the Switch version just cause it's the only physical version I have even though we're playing the PC version now. We're starting out with this with Undertale. Then we're going into Fire Emblem Awakening, Lunatic Plus Classic, and then we're doing Skyward Sword with a freaking Wiimote rifle thing. Is what we're doing for the main event. You just notice, you know, notice nothing what box is perfect, man. Should I put these somewhere on my desk so I can show them since we're doing that now? Challenge PMD without a single death. I need to do things that only take a little while. That I can do like in short spurts, not like a whole playthrough or something. Because, because there's like the choices for them, right? So they're to fill the one hour time slots. I can't do a freaking PMD run in one hour. So those who help fundraise for Lurch like that to help people with developmental disabilities will get to choose from this stuff to fill these one hour time slots. So no, that's not one. Now the only choices are the ones that are here and and like Mario Party because I have a whole bunch of games for that and there wasn't enough space for them. But yeah, um, 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 um. But yeah, so there's that. Then I have a stack here. I have like a whole bunch of stacks of these different games here. My goodness. So like here's my freaking PS2 and like Xbox 360 games that there's choices to. So there's like that SpongeBob game that was on there. 
there's that random Pirates of the Caribbean game that was on my shelf, the freaking Pac-Man thing, that golf thing. I don't know why I own a COD game, but it'd be kind of meme to play. Like the first Assassin's Creed game. And then there was Smash Melee that I was originally going to have as a choice, but I couldn't find the power cable to my Wii, so that sucks. And there's my squeaky chair. And then I have like a whole bunch of Wii games that I can barely put my hands around. I have the choices between Poke Park 1 and Poke Park 2. I don't actually know where 1 went, I just know where 2 is, but I can emulate the first one. I guess I misplaced it. So we got that, we got freaking these two Mario parties, and then there's Mario Party 10, I suppose, so there's like choices for that. Wii Sports Resort, Wii Fit, someone's totally gonna make me play Wii Fit, aren't they? There's the first Mario and Sonic game at the Olympics. Eminem's Beach Party, best game ever, and Guitar Hero and stuff are choices. Then on the DS here, I have, like, Hell's Kitchen for the Nintendo DS, best game ever, as well as Mario Party DS, and the case here's thicker because I got it in Germany, and for some reason, the Nintendo DS cases were thicker if you got them in Germany. And then there's, like, a handful of... I just dropped them all. Handful of, like, Switch games here. Breath of the Wild, because my love-hate relationship with it, and Skyrim, because it's a meme. This, because I, like, never continued it, and, like, Super Mario Party and stuff. And would it be a challenge for Smash Bros? I don't know. I don't know, man, but those are, like, the choices that I have there. Yeah, we fit Guitar Hero through the fire and the flames. If somebody fills a slot with it, I'll have to play it, but... But we shall see what happens. Where'd my volume go? Oi. Oh, there's just no sound for the game right now. Gotcha. Do I really have to use oven mitts for, like, the left hand as well? Because it's only the right one that matters. Let's just put it on anyway. Screw it. Screw it, man. But yeah, PMD took like 12 hours in a single stream and even more throughout separate streams. Yeah, I mean, I... Pretty much all the PMD games I've played, I've beaten in like one or two streams. And I've pulled like an all-nighter in. It's probably the closest I've done to staying up 24 hours before is my PMD streams. Though I wasn't actually streaming for 24 hours. Until today. You know. Okay. The Smash the Gold Joy-Con in hard mode, no spirits, world of light. Sticky keys or something. Yeah, that sounds kind of... Kind of terrible. Nope. 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 No, no, no. Any percent PMD speed run? I'm not doing it, puppy or gam. It's just the choices that are there. Doing games I wouldn't normally normally stream, and those are the choices that are there. Alrighty, let's we go again. We go again. One shot no, it's just the choices that are on the on the thing there and in my Discord server that I put. In fact, I think I think Super Smash Bros. Melee is still one of the choices in the Discord server plans. I think I need to I think I need to remove that. Hold on. Hold on. Do I have Yeah, GameCube, Super Smash Bros. Melee. I need to remove that because I couldn't actually get that to be working there. Yeah, so that has to go away. And um And I can't do seven for the same reason. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Edited it. Poifect. Poifect, man. Yeah, I never heard of it before. Can I attack, please? There we go. Jeez. Up, down, left, right. Up. Am I pressing shift? Is that the other key I'm pressing? Or what's going on there? What am I pressing? Am I pressing alt? No? Oh dang it, what the heck is this? It freaking froze the game for a second. Okay, up, down, left, right. Got it, maybe. Maybe got it. Boop, boop, boop. Yeah, this is definitely way easier than that. And you can't do that. That'd be okay, I'm a Dang it. This is what happens when I look at chat while I try to do this. Press Alt once and Shift twice. I wonder why it makes that sound. I wonder what it is. Well, I mean, there's the extra count that was already added to it, so I mean. 
So I may as well leave it as is without adding another one now. I said without adding another one now because you wrote exclamation point undyne minus one, so now it's one higher than it's supposed to be. I wonder how I make the commands mod only. I think that there might be a way. Because I kind of want to do that so it can't just be increased like that when it's not supposed to be increased. Meh. G arm. Down, left, right. Up, down, left, right. Boop, boop. If anybody does go out of their way to, like, make the counter inaccurate, though, I'm just gonna give out timeouts, though. <laughs> Will be the solution, then. Yeah, I'm sure there's probably a way to make commands mod only. I don't know what it is, though. <laughs> Something I'll figure out another day. And hello, up and down one. Is this a new account? Did you... What? No! I pressed the freaking... No! Look at this! Look what I did! Look what I did here! It's not even gonna switch scenes. Dang it, that's the wrong layout. I freaking pressed the window key and then I started typing Z into the search bar. What happens when you play with oven mitts on? But yeah, not sure exactly how about you've seen before on Noble Tofu stream. Yeah, there's probably a probably a way. I would imagine. Same person, two accounts, sorry for that, don't worry about it. So did something happen to the other account, or you just want to have a second account, because why not? <laughs> or something. Up, down, left, right. Up, down, left, right. I was trying to switch my layout so you could see exactly what happened to me there. But I switched to Smash Bros. one by accident, and then it, like, minimized. <laughs> it took a little bit. I wasn't expecting it to open the... Windows search bar. This is what happens when you wear oven mitts and you don't know what buttons you're pressing. Press the freaking Windows key by accident and then start typing Z into the search bar. Oh man. But yeah, nothing happened to the others, so you just have two accounts just because. Just because. Move! Move! Up! Up! I'm holding up right now! I swear! It's over. It's over, man. I was holding up, man. And believe me, I looked at the input screen there to see what was actually being pressed. So I know. All I need now is for Siri to button and this couldn't get any worse. Thing is, I can say Siri like that, and my phone doesn't do anything, but I say random other words like seriously in like the middle of a sentence, and my phone is just like, oh, you called? Like, look at this. Hey, Siri. Okay, freaking right when I need it to not... not work to showcase that example, then it's like, how about I work the way I'm supposed to this time? Of course. What happens if I say, hey, seriously? That, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Up, down, left, right. Up, down, left, right. Yeah, yeah. Boopity boppity. Boop, boop, boop. Okay. Boopity bop. Alright, as long as I don't get hit during these first three attacks. Are you trying to do a genocide run? I am doing a genocide run. I'm not just trying, I am doing it. But with oven mitts on. It's over, yep. You get hit during the first three attacks and I have no chance towards end. Because I won't have enough health. Man, oh man. What a world. What a world indeed, let me tell ya. Okay, we gotta...
beat Undyne before we before we transition to Fire Emblem Awakening. We have an hour and a half. Whoops. That was a mistake. But yeah, I'd also appreciate there not being... Like, I should have said this earlier, but I'd also appreciate there not being spoilers for the actual final boss of Genocide. Run this upload after for anybody who doesn't know the story. It can be a surprise for, but I guess it's too late now. So that, that sucks. They have to watch this whole thing again because I reset the game. Dang it, man. Now we have to watch the whole cutscene again. I reset the whole thing. Like, not the shorter version. We have to watch, like, the long version. I guess maybe I should have put, like, no spoilers as one of my tags. That's what I could do. Yeah, here's the whole thing. Okay. Ma, ma, ma. Up, down, left, right. Up, down, left, right. And Z. And that speech is like a decade long? Yeah, it certainly can be. Yeah, I didn't mean to have to reset the game there. Silly me. Silly me. Ah. Oh boy, oh boy. All right. So scary. So scary, man. What? What happened? What am I unaware of here? I really shouldn't have gone up here. Go down. Down, 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 please. I had an idea, but it's too late now. Why does my computer keep making noises? Too late for the idea, you'll say. Bop. Ah, phase is always the same, so it's easy. Should have incorporated Deltarune as a choice? No, because Deltarune is something I want to actually do like a playthrough of. All the stuff that I incorporate is either like dumb games or like dumb challenges with games. I'm not gonna do like an actual serious playthrough for the sake of charity because there's nothing like unique about that. I need to finish streaming Undertale before I can go over to Deltarune. Is also the thing. How did that hit me? So no, no Delta Rune. Unless I did like Avamit's challenge with that, but like, I can't afford to heal before then. I don't think to have the strongest possible. Like, run there. I need to not heal until after both of the spinny things, but. But I don't know, man. Nah, I have to stream stuff in a non serious way for charity. Deltrune, when I get to that, will be streamed in a serious way. So, not that. But Deltrune doesn't sound as bad. I don't even know how Deltrune plays, so I wouldn't know. Like. Because I'll be going into it blind when I eventually do. So I don't even know how that game plays. I will one day do it blind. Alrighty. I've gotten so close to beating Undyne so much. So many times now. Literally so close. Man, oh man. This is a very good game. Isn't there just like the one chapter of it out right now? And I still have to like develop the other ones. What is this fuzz that's in the oven? Oh boy, oh boy. Nah, I gotta stream stuff I don't normally stream in a non-serious way. Which is why I also didn't really want to have Smash Bros as an option. 
there. Unless there is some crazy thing to do and that whole spiritless single Joy-Con thing sounds kind of, kind of no bueno though. <laughs> so I don't know about all that, I may just stick to the list. This is what may happen. I just need to get to those later parts. Come on! What the heck, man? What even? Sweet Easter egg, you should try to find the hints towards chapter two. I won't be streaming that for a while. First we have to beat Undertale Genocide and then like at some point shoot Pacifist. That's probably not gonna happen for a while. Horribly. Man, oh man, oh man. Starting to get a little lightheaded. Should maybe get some break fast. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Up, down, left, right. Up, down, left, right. Alrighty. Boopity bop. As long as I don't get hit during those first three attacks. Because they should be easy, yet I messed them up anyway. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty. Ah. Oh, didn't enter it the first time. Aren't we also one higher than it should be? So shouldn't there also be one death that shouldn't be counted just because we're like one higher than it's supposed to be? Or something like that? <sighs> How? Man. What do you want from me, game? Yeah, yeah, I know, Windows. I know you like to make weird sounds that make no sense. Oh. Oh, man. Dang it, man. Maybe I should also have it somewhere on the screen, like a little notification saying that you can choose my games with the slots there. Maybe I should... Oh, you already took care of that? Alright. Boy, you fixed. Thanks, Aunt. Died once and no one pressed the command. Okay, that's perfect, then. But yeah, or I could just throw it somewhere in the stream title. Maybe I'll do that after this. After this win. After this victory over Undyne. We're on a good track so far. We're halfway. Dang it. Oh, dang it, man! Fine, I'll do a small heal here. Oh, come on! I was pressing down! Well, so much for being on a good track. So much for that, then. Okay. Okay. Dang it, Windows! Yeah, right after this win, I'll change the stream title. Huh. See, you mess one up, you mess them all up. See what I say, that phase is easy until you mess one up and then you mess up the rest. Always, every single time. Man, oh man. How did that go up, please? I'm dead now, aren't I? What the heck, man? Go up! It's not going the way that I want it to. Up, down, left, right. Up, down, left, right. On. I'm still so far away. Oh man, what do I even have left? I have one more snowman piece and I have the pie. Okay, I'm gonna take the oven mitts off just to press back. Cause I'm gonna freaking mess it up otherwise. Can you excuse me doing that? Up, down, left, right. I was pressing it. 
Oh no! Don't go down! Dang, man. This phase. This phase is the one that really hurts my knuckles. Gloves versus Undyne, exactly. How's it going today? Oh, I can't read right now. Dang it. How's it going today, Jameis? Ah, uh, come on, Windows. Mm. I need to survive this. It's this phase. The easy phase. <gasps> no! <gasps> yes, finally. Finally! It only took like, I've been streaming this for like an hour and a half now and last time I spent like three hours with it total So it took me like four and a half hours to beat Undone with Ovimit, but I finally did it Oh man, and you could do like 1600 damage with the battle issues on Undyne. I guess that's a freaking <laughs> Item that I could have picked up earlier. Oops <laughs> Oops that probably would have been easier for the of its challenge. Oh my goodness. How many attempts were we at? I need to scroll up on the chat box there. 79. I got before 80. It took 79 attempts to beat Undyne with Elven Mitt. Oh. oh my heart. Oh my goodness, man. Oh, finally. Oh my goodness, 79 attempts to beat Undyne with Oven Myths. Oh, my heart is beating out of my chest right now. I... Oh man. It's actually beating so hard. Alright, I want to thank my family, my friends, my community. I couldn't have done this without you, yada yada. Oh man. Oh. Oh. I need to save ASAP, I swear. Damn it. So even that power wasn't enough? <laughs> if you... If you think I'm gonna give up hope, you're wrong. Because I've got my friends behind me. Luffy's told me that she would watch me fight you. And if anything went wrong... I'm so lightheaded, both from that and from doing this voice where I whisper. She would evacuate everyone. By now, she's called Asgore and told him to absorb the six human souls. And with that power, this world will live on. <sighs> save, 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 save. Save right now. Save right now. Where's the save point? There's a save point. Determination. <laughs> we beat Undyne with oven mitts. <laughs> oh my goodness. And apparently without even having the best equipment, we did it. Oh man. It's one hell of a victory. But his reality sets in victory short-lived. Enjoy it while it lasts. You know what? Yeah, I know exactly why. But yeah, I was like, yeah, this last hit is going to finish it. And then it didn't. And I knew that I had to survive that one last attack that I always die in. <laughs> or else I'd be... I'd be dead. Oh man. Well, 7.45 a.m. in the morning, and I mean, I'm doing the Undertale of Amit's challenge, but it's not really much of a challenge until like the next boss fight anyway. So right now could be a perfect time for me to actually go get like some cereal for breakfast because you know, it's a 24 hour stream. So maybe I'll do that. I probably won't even need to use of Amit's for this stuff coming up because I'm just gonna one shot everything. And on a good note, you'll be back already. Yeah, I'm gonna just... I could have, like, Nightbot playing some... Some music or something like that. Gotta do some stuff for New House already. I'm gonna queue up, like, you, me, and Gravity. From Planet Coaster into Nightbot. 
probably some other Planet Coaster music, like how about Aspect Imagine... How do I spell it? Imaginarium. I spell that right? Yep. Um... Here, I'll queue up Planet Coaster music, and then like... And like some Ori in the Blind Forest orchestrated. Or never mind, it's just the regular OST. So, um, but yeah, see you within two hours or so. Good job, by the way. Thanks, Hot. <laughs> Good luck with the house stuff. Okay, let's turn that up. All right, for now, how about I put up just the music, or the screen saying that. And I am going to be right back. I'm going to get like some cereal and then I'll finally adjust my stream title. Oh, what I say? What I say? After that win, I was going to adjust my stream title. I told you so. I'm going to, I'll just leave the screen up for now. And I'm going to go get like some cereal and be right back or something. Unless there's something else I can find for breakfast, but I'm probably going to get some cereal to help fuel me on this 24 hour stream. I'll be right back. All right, I have returned. I put my headphones back in. And I'll put my jacket back on. Okay, I guess I really didn't have to queue up as much music as I thought. But yeah, almost 8 a.m. Time to have some time to have some breakfast to fuel me for this. 24 hour stream. I've never had meals on stream like this before. I've never had to. I've never done a 24 hour before. So, so let's just pour some cereal because now is a better time than any now that, now that we've beaten Undyne. In Undertale there. Because now I can actually have the camera off while I eat because I can't turn the camera off while facing Undyne and then you don't know that I'm playing with oven mitts. But until the next boss fight, it doesn't really matter. In fact, I can probably just play without oven mitts until the next boss fight because I'm just gonna go around one-shotting everything anyway. You know? Man! Cereal! Roll up that bag again. I'ma have to 
pour some milk. I'm gonna turn off the camera. I don't actually think it's gonna turn off the camera until I switch scenes, though. Pour that syrup, or pour that milk, not pour the cereal. 